many people, a sidewalk is the way to get around the city, but to others, a sidewalk can cause obstacles to get around. If a sidewalk doesn't have a curb cut, which is essentially a small ramp on or off the sidewalk, someone with a mobility disability who uses a cane, wheelchair, motorized scooter, or walker can neither cross the street safely nor cross at all. Curb cuts sometimes have textured areas that alert people with vision impairments that the sidewalk is transitioning into the street. Wall set up, I'm officially the bionic woman. Here in Seattle, we took our cameras out and found that not all sidewalks in Seattle are safe for people to use. Really? If you have a crappy curb in your neighborhood, post a video or photo using the hashtag crappy curb. Curb cuts are ramps from the sidewalk to the crosswalk that allow people with mobility disabilities to cross the street safely. But sometimes, cities only install one curb cut for two crosswalks. The one curb cut is not within the painted lines of either crosswalk. This causes people with mobility disabilities to travel into oncoming traffic. And the worst case scenario is that someone gets hit. Sometimes, curb cuts aren't maintained, which lead to cracks. And mobility devices, such as my scooter, get stuck on crumbling curbs. And in some cases, there are no curb cuts at all, forcing people to travel longer distances, sometimes into oncoming traffic, just to get where they need to go. make sure people with mobility disabilities can navigate cities safely and have equal access. How's your community doing? Send us photos and videos using the hashtag CrappyCurve. Follow us at Rooted and Rights for more stories from the disability rights movement. Disability rights are human rights. Rooted in rights.